I'm going to show you how to screen mirror any iPod touch to any TV, computer monitor, even a projector, as long as the device has an HDMI port in the back. The reason is because we're going to go ahead and connect it with an HDMI cable and a digital, digital AV adapter right here. Okay, so first thing that you need is a one of these digital AV adapters. This is a lightning to an HDMI here. So you plug your HDMI cable into here and the other HDMI side you plug into your TV or monitor or projector. And you also have a lightning port here so that you can mirror your iPod Touch and you can charge it the same time. So let me do this. Let me go ahead and connect my HDMI to my TV here. So I just connected the other side of the um, HDMI cable to my TV here. And now let me go ahead and plug this in like this. And you can charge your iPod Touch as well if you plug your lightning uh, charging cable into here. Anyways, next thing you do is just plug this into your iPod Touch. Okay, so now I have it connected. The next thing you got to do is make sure that your TV or monitor or projector is on the correct HDMI port. So you just want to go ahead and go to Import or Settings or Source on your remote. And so now I have to, oops, let me bring this back up. I know it's on HDMI 3 because that's the only one that's highlighted. So let me just go right here. Let me go ahead and click on Enter. And then as soon as I do that, give it a second here. And voila. Now take note, if I put my phone to sleep, it'll do the same thing on there as well. And you can see we can mirror here no problem. Even if I go into an Explorer here or Safari, you can go ahead and read whatever's on the browser. You can zoom in and zoom out. You can play games in here. You can watch YouTube videos as well. 8 plus, 7 plus, and you have an issue where it's not reading your network card or your SIM card. Basically, it's take note that the volume actually comes out from the TV, not the actual iPod. Okay? And what else we can do here? If you have photos and videos, you can go ahead and relay everything onto the big screen as well. You tap on that. There's a photo here, and you can zoom in and out as well. And I'll play a video here as well. Oh, let me put the uh, play, let me put the volume up. One, two, three. Testing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And again, same thing, the volume comes out of the TV, not the actual iPod. So pretty simple to do. And if you want to go ahead and disconnect or whatnot, this is great to show like work documents too and stuff like that. Anyways, if you want to go ahead and disconnect, you just pull the plug. Pretty simple.